Alrighty, everybody. I've been working on this black Escalade for two days now, doing the brake lines. And um, as you can see, we've got the black plastic coated lines from the dealer. So I wanted to go over a few things on doing these brake lines that'll make your life a lot easier. Um, the first thing you wanna do is you wanna draw a map. So I've driven up, drawn a map. This car here has four wheel ABS. So it's got four lines running to all the tires and plus the two lines running down. So what I have done is I have drawn a map of everything of how it goes. So this is the, this is the uh, proportioning valve here. The front of the proportioning valve goes to the back of the ABS controller underneath the driver's seat. The back of the master cylinder runs down and runs to the front. Then you have the left front, the right front, the left rear, and the right rear that comes out of this. So the order that you want to do after you pull out the lines is you want to do the left rear line first, then the right rear line, then you're going to do the left front line, then you're going to do the right front line, all right? And then you have the two feeder lines that come down, and I do believe I did the back one first, and then I did the front one because it's... Actually, no, I did not. I did the front one first because it sits in the bottom of this one holder, and then I did the back line because it sits on top of it. So, there's my little map if you want a little cheating. I will probably try, maybe I will rewrite this and post this up on Instagram so it's a little bit easier to understand. Um, but that is how we did it. And this one here, you, I did have to get the scanner out to uh, um, bleed the system. There are all the lines in the holder and on up into the proportioning valve here. I'm trying to get some light in here for you all. There it is, new lines there. I even replaced the lines going to the master cylinder and it even gives you a new line going to the ABS pump right there. So I would highly recommend using the dealer lines. They actually fit better than any of the other lines that I've seen. I've used the stainless steel lines and they're hard to work with and bend, bend around and get them in. I've used the Dorman set, they're not quite bent right. This is the actual original General Motors set and they fit the best. Um, because part of the problem is, is the right front line runs all the way from that computer all the way up here, then across the cross member and then over to the right front wheel. So it's a very difficult job. Um, it took me, uh, let me see, I worked on it four hours yesterday and about five hours today. And then I had to extract the bleeders. So be prepared to uh, put calipers on if you can't get the bleeders taken out. And you are gonna need a scanner to bleed the brakes. All right, everybody, this was just a really fast one. I know I didn't show you how you do it, but I showed you which lines go in first and which order they go into. That is a really plus when you're doing this. If you put them in in that order, everything's gonna go smooth. Get the original General Motors lines. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. You can always do that in that corner. And if you can, would like to leave me something, you can always leave me a little thanks right there. All right, everybody, thanks a lot for watching. We'll catch you all later.